Today we're going to talk about the health benefits of okra. They call it ladyfinger. 70% of this vegetable is made out of fiber. It's much higher in protein than other vegetables. It's high in manganese, vitamin C, vitamin K1, B6, and folate. There's a couple unique things about okra. Number one, it's high in something called mucilage, which is this gel-like glue that binds with cholesterol and triglycerides so it can help regulate your fats. And it also absorbs and binds water, so it is good for constipation as well. But most of the benefits from okra don't come from its vitamins and minerals. It comes from its phytonutrients. There was a study done in India that showed it had anti-stress properties. It can act as an adaptogen. And there was a study out of China that showed it had anti-fatigue properties, actually lowering the amount of lactic acid that is retained after exercise. It can help people with constipation, but its biggest benefit is in what it can do for your blood sugars. So if you're diabetic, okra is a very good thing to consume. So it decreases the absorption of actual sugar. It was shown to increase insulin output, which can actually help a diabetic. It increases insulin sensitivity because we know with diabetes you have insulin resistance. And on top of that, it increases enzymes that help you break down sugar. So that's my quick video on the benefits of okra. Hey, before you leave, I just wanted to give you a little quick history on some of the books that I wrote. This was one of the first books it's called Dr. Berg Body Shapes. It was my attempt at um, writing about body types. Uh, what was very interesting about this book is I actually did all the images myself. Uh, don't ask me why. Um, they look actually not quite as professional as some of the uh, images that I have in the new book. But anyway, this is my first attempt right here called Dr. Berg's Body Shape Diets. Uh, and then I wrote a book um, more extensive called The Seven Principles of Fat Burning. I don't even have a copy anymore, actually, um, because it's outdated. Uh, the next book, uh, I put about a thousand hours into this one right here called The New Body Type Guide. Major updates on the body types. Uh, I put a lot of energy into this. Uh, it has professional images, graphics, all sorts of things. Now, the problem with this book is it doesn't really describe what this is really about. Body types are only a small portion of what's in this book. And that's why I changed the name to The Healthy Keto Plan. Okay. If you happen to have this book, you don't really need this book because there's some only very, very minor updates. But if you don't have this, you need to get this one right here. Um, this book goes into every single detail that you would ever want to know about. It goes into the seven principles of fat burning. It goes into hormones, uh, the body types, the basic keto plan. It goes into intermittent fasting. I talk about the 10 fat burning triggers and blockers and fat burning strategies with a lot of details in every single chapter. I go into body issues that interfere with losing weight. Um, there's very few people that just have a weight problem. They have a lot of body issues, whether it's sleeping problems, uh, stress problems, inflammation, menopause. I cover that extensively in this book. Then I talk about how to get rid of stress and I show you a technique. Uh, then I get into exercising. And then I have a lot of really good recipes in this book as well. So uh, this is a good reference guide. Um, on my website, if you get this book, you get this one free. It's called Healthy Keto Intermittent Fasting. This is the shortcut, uh, quick guide to this book. And uh, the reason I created this book is to have you, within 45 minutes, learn how to do keto, okay, in intermittent fasting, exactly what you need to do. Then you can fill in the blanks with this book right here. So right now I'm doing a special. If you get this book, you get this one totally free, or you can go to Amazon and get these individually. So I just want to clarify the difference between this book and this updated one right here. If you don't have this, you need to get this right here. That way you can get the exact correct information to do it healthily.